The girl turns her head. Her face is covered with scars. The priest is exercising her. She plugs her ears and rolls her eyes. Suddenly, the lights begin to flicker. The girl backs up and crawls to the ceiling. The priest is still praying, but the girl's face becomes more hideous. She suddenly jumps to the ground and walks to the window, looking helplessly at the noon. But the demon soon takes over her consciousness again. Worms burrowed out of the girl's hands. Another priest decided to exorcise the demon himself. The girl suddenly went under the bed. He moves to the edge of the bed to see what's going on. The girl gets up from the other end. Her body is almost folded in half. Nun calls out the girl's name and she seems to regain consciousness. But the demon seized back control in an instant. The girl's hair dug into her mouth and she was on the verge of suffocation. The priest tugged on the girl's hair, the noon prayed. Finally, the demon inside the girl was temporarily suppressed. 